I'm here with Steve Nicholson, Chief Football Writer at the Derby Telegraph after the Rams 3-2 win over Huddersfield. Steve, what did you make of that? Well, it's a welcome win. I think that's the first thing we've got to say. You know, back-to-back league defeats are rare for Derby County and they suffered them at the hands of Wigan and, of course, at Brentford on Saturday, which, uh, which was a game they didn't handle particularly well. So I think tonight, you know, Steve McLaren talks a lot about performances, but I think tonight was about the win. Very important win it was too. You know, and uh, the game was a little bit too open for me. For those who, who know, I like I like to see defences, uh, you know, on top to an extent. But uh, Huddersfield, the mayor, had a real go. Derby had a go as well. There was plenty of openings at both ends. Uh, and all in all, as I say, I think the important thing is is the win. It was edgy at times. It wasn't always convincing by Derby. But you know, they scored three goals. That'll do the confidence of the world of good. They conceded two. I mean, that's eight now in the last four games. That's something that needs to be to, to be worked on and looked at. And I'm sure I asked Steve McLaren about that a few minutes ago, and he said uh, when they get to the international break, it gives them time to work on that type of thing. Because when you have three games in eight days and a batch of those fixtures, there's very little time to work on on things on the training ground because it's all about recovery and then the next game. So I'm sure you'll be looking at that. Uh, but as I say. I think uh, in the context of everything, the win was the most important thing. Steve McLaren made three changes to his starting lineup tonight. Went for a uh, central midfield trio of Omar Mascarell, Will Hughes and Jeff Hendrick. Yeah, he did. And, and there was a lot of discussion about uh, the team selection at Brentford on, on Saturday. Uh, I went on record to say I, I didn't think it was, it was the right choice. That wasn't with hindsight. It was uh, something we mentioned before the Brentford game. Uh, but yeah, Mascarell kept his place in, in central midfield ahead of John Eustis. I thought tonight, actually, he, he did a lot better than he did on Saturday. And one of the interesting things about tonight was, when he was on the ball, I think his first look was forward. And you know, often in this pass we've seen him and he gets it and tends to go side to side, which is fine. But now and again, to really damage the opponent, you have to look forward with your pass. And I thought he did that quite well. Those two or three passes went astray when they got a bit nervy at times. And, uh, and uh, that, that happens, you know. But I think the, the credit to the lad himself, he doesn't hide. He always wants the ball again, and that's a really good sign. Yeah, so he played. Will Hughes came back into the side again. I always feel Derby's football is better when he plays. And uh, Jeff Hendrick kept his place. Craig Bryson was injured uh, with a bit of a back problem. So we don't know quite who might have missed out had Craig been fit, whether it had been Craig himself or one of the others. Uh, Steve McLaren says he's hoping that Craig Bryson should train on Thursday so we may well be fit for the weekend game but uh, Ryan Shotton came in at the back uh, again you know that's an interesting competition with him and Jake Brooks and Zach Whitbread when he's fit to see who will partner Richard Keel. I think one of the problems with them conceding goals at the moment is there's maybe a bit of uncertainty in there when you haven't got a settled centre-back pairing and the new goalkeepers come in behind them as well and a new central midfield player in front of them so there's a bit of uncertainty there and a bit of getting used to each other so that's maybe not a, a surprise but uh, I say all in all on the night a good win and Derby going to the international break uh, with another home game against Wolves on Saturday yeah I mean uh, you know another home game as you say Wolves have done really well uh, they're right up there they lost tonight at Ipswich I understand uh, it's a TV game it's an early kick off and uh, another chance for Derby to put points on the board and this win will have done him the world of good, I think. As I say, he's got that kind of little bit of edginess out the way of, of those back-to-back defeats. So the back on track as such, uh, though it was never really a major concern. Uh, so they've got Wolves, and as I say, if you can get another win, it'll take them into the international break in great shape.